Hello, in this video we will see how to uh, apply uh, the about and uh, mentions uh, schema markup uh, for a Dutch website using the Inlix platform. For uh, this, vid this vid video I have taken an example of a uh, Dutch website called uh, tooltester.com uh, forward slash nl. So I'm going to take this domain URL, going to copy it and then go back to Inlix and then create a new project for this website. So I'm clicking here on add that website, indicating the domain name, and then I'm going to select the uh, English United States as a market, then click on next. I'm going to start from scratch to create this, uh, this project here. I'm going to build from scratch. Okay, so once we have this uh, screen on Inlix, I can add specific pages within a, the a Dutch website here. So I'm going to click on Add Pages. Take this URL as an example. And then paste the URL here and then click on Save in Project. The tool is taking a couple of seconds to analyze the page. Then we will go back here to the uh, top pages parts. And then we will see this, uh, this page added into the project. So uh, this article itself is about how to create websites. And so the idea would be here to um, associate the, uh, this, this page on Inlinks to, the, um, to the, its most corresponding topic, topic, which is website. So if I click here on the target button, we will see all the uh, topics that the Inlinks tool has uh, recognized from the content of this page and we will associate the um, this URL with the uh, concept of websites. I'm going to click on website, select here, then I'm going to refresh the page, refresh the URL, and here on the, on the schema uh, column I can see that uh, the check here is displayed, which means that a schema markup has been uh, generated for this page. So if, I, if we click on the, on the check here, we will see that this is a specific type of schema called uh, about and mentions. So this is since we have associated, associated the page with websites, so it's uh, taking the, uh, the concept of website and making a correspondence with its corresponding uh, page on Wikipedia about website. Same thing as for the mentions part, which are the... Um, here we are, we are, are some of the secondary mentions of the content of the page, such as LinkedIn, Facebook, JavaScript, PHP, and CSS. So uh, on, under the, uh, the, schema, uh, the schema part here, you can see uh, all the schemas that are generated uh, on, the, on an Elix project for a Dutch website. And you, you, if you wish to do so, you can still modify a schema here by clicking on the schema, which is generated for this page. So if we click on Edit Schema, uh, we can uh, remove a, a line from the uh, About and Mentions Schema, and we can also add a topic uh, in the, of the, into the schema of this page by clicking on Add a Topic, indicating a word for, for the topic and uh, placing the its corresponding Wikipedia page here. Uh, please note that uh, currently, as of uh, October 2021, uh, Inlinks does not uh, function to uh, place uh, internal links uh, automatically for Dutch websites. So we do advise to go to the, if, you, if you're willing to use a links to apply schema for a Dutch uh, website, to switch the links here off in the internal links part. Um, also about the, the schema implementation, the, the schema that are generated for a Dutch website, uh, it is implemented automatically on the website using a piece of JavaScript code, which is provided by, uh, by Inlinx. And this JavaScript code here needs to be uh, installed in the footer of the website and then uh, validated here on the project in order for the system to uh, implement these uh, about and mention schema automatically on a Dutch website. So I hope this is uh, useful. If you need any help, you can uh, reach out to us on the uh, chat uh, option inside of the Inlinks platform. So uh, thank you very much for your attention, and I hope to see you very soon.